one event completely overshadowed the game at Birmingham City, and that was the horrific injury suffered by Eduardo after a challenge from Martin Taylor. His teammates were visibly distressed by the extent of it, and it was later confirmed to be a broken leg and dislocated ankle. The Croatian was expected to be out of football for the next nine months. Everyone's thoughts were with Eduardo as he left the pitch, and the players then had the tough task of refocusing back on the game. It wasn't easy, particularly when some of the decisions that followed seemed to add insult to that awful injury. It's McFadden, and he's done it too, it's a glorious goal! His first at St Andrews for Birmingham City. Taylor comes to that, he's beaten in the air. Oh, and it's put into the back of the net. Theo Walcott and Arsenal are level. It's his first ever Premier League goal for Arsenal. Bit of room out here for Fabregas. Not quite the touch out of by all men, but it fell nicely for Alex Webb anyway. Deflected, and another fine save from Taylor, who had to readjust. This is getting hard and harder for Birmingham now. And the bio out to Theo Walker again, little cushion, and Fabregas has hit the post, and this time Lady Luck was smiling on Birmingham. McFadden, and only found Olivier Capo, who looks frustrated, the former Juventus player. Yeah, might have gone in between Sendos and Gallas with that pass. Walker, meanwhile, on the left foot, and he's got another one too, and that is a terrific goal to put Arsenal ahead is the Theo Walcott show here in the second half at St Andrews it's a mistake by Ridgewell and he didn't even look for Bettner who was to his left and wide open because he's got a goal and he just fancied another one it's a wonderful finish this is unsavable they're running out of time and not the best course no Oh, there's a mistake there by Cleach, he's had a penalty kick, it is! Maybe salvation for Birmingham! Oh, my goodness me! It's McFadden against Almunia, who's been recalled to the side today. What drama! And McFadden has done it! Two goals for him, two for Birmingham, and the most improbable of points! It's very difficult to swallow because on the day so uh, so much happened. But then again, maybe we could not deal well with that frustration, and uh, that's what we have to learn of keep our calm and continue to win the ne just the next game. The injury was very difficult, you know, for uh, for Eduardo, you know, because he can play for nine nine months, you know, and uh, that injury was very very bad, you know. So uh, everybody think. Uh, about him, you know. As a player on the pitch, if you see, if you saw those things, you know, you just in your head, oh, why him, why not me? And that's, that, those things can happen to you just in a minute, you know what I mean? So those are the things that was very difficult to take. You don't want to see that in your career, and uh, luckily I didn't go close to see, because I could tell by the players' reactions it wasn't wasn't the best sight. Um, but hopefully, you know, he'll fight back and uh, be back for the season very quickly, hopefully.